Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's another week. It is another vlog. So on today's vlog, I am going to be showing you guys basically what I do on set as a producer. Um, well, not just on set, but what I do to prepare for a shoot. I've been preparing the whole week and finally today I am flying to Durban. I was actually supposed to go tomorrow, but there's some emergency that requires me to be in Durban because I am shooting in Durban this weekend, a music video. So I have to quickly get there and sort a mess out. And a big part of being a producer is extinguishing fires. I am a problem solver, basically. That's what I get paid to do solve problems so i am gonna leave johannesburg in the next few kids is coming to pick me up my fave and then go to durban sort the shit out so let's get to it Durban is stunning. Why don't I come here more often? I mean, just if we can't get in the tomb. I mean, really. Guys, they're cruising. I'm going to go 60 days to go. And go here. They're cruising. Like, cruise ship. Guys, go show you my app. Like, in the internet, go here. But that is the least of my problems. I cannot get permits for my shoot. On Monday so that is my biggest struggle right now I am parked outside the place where you get the permits and they are closed for today I doubt they open on Sunday but I'm gonna be here tomorrow morning hopefully I can sort it out because if I don't have it I don't know how my shoot is gonna go if it's gonna go so yeah I'm high key stressed high key stressed like high key stressed so I have literally been working the whole day. The time now is, what's the time? Why does my camera do that? Oh, I know why. I just, because it's following my face. The time now is six. And I've been working the whole day. Uzola just called and she wants to go for a drink. And you know what? I'm more than happy to oblige. To oblige, as long as it's just one, because I've got work to do tomorrow on a Sunday. Come on, uh, let's get. This is what we do it. Good morning. So right now I am on my way to Kloof, which is about thirty minutes from where I am. I just need to go pick up some smoke bombs, and um. Oopsie, what did I do? Um, my crew is on their way from Johannesburg. I think they're basically here, like an hour away from here. And then my director is flying in from Cape Town. Ooh, my glasses. Um, so she's almost here as well. So I'm just going to pick up these things before they get here. And then go meet them at our accoms, our accommodation. We just got accommodation very close to where we will be shooting tomorrow so let me go to Kloof I'm getting so lost I've been driving around Kloof for the past 15 minutes and, and I've noticed that um, I've driven around in circles like I'm back at where I started I don't know how my ways in Durban is not working at its optimal level because always never does this to me in Jogu. Hey, but the location Reiki normally happens a day or two before the actual shoot day. This is where the director and director of photography get to plan their shots properly. And then I, as the producer, get to see the facilities, where the toilets are, where the parkings are, um, if there are any shops around where I'll be able to feed my crew. This will help greatly in terms of being prepared before the actual shoot day. There's my director. 
Don't break. Rob, you've done this before, right? Uh -oh. Okay, so today is shoot day. I don't know if you guys can see my face because the sun is quite bright. Today is shoot day, but I have permits to sort out first. So I'm walking to there's like a printing shop nearby. Just need to print out some stuff, then go to the municipal offices to get the permits, and then hopefully I get them so we can shoot. Because if I don't get them. <laughs> Guys, how you doing? <laughs> I can see. How's it looking? Rob? We are shooting movies. It's a shooter, I'm a movie. My little den, the monitor. I've had such a crazy morning, like getting these permits was a mission. But get up salary right now, we are doing the Lord's work, and that's all that matters. Everyone is running. Ooh, I must not get into frame. In order to be allowed to shoot in public spaces, the production will need to have a permit. This is normally obtained from the municipality or the traffic department. The cost of the permit also varies from city to city. If there are any additional special vehicles or blockages of roads that occur during the shoot, there will be an additional charge to your basic permit. Second location. My team hard at work while I sit. Hey, ready? Where is he? So the shoot is going well. I am needing to feed my crew now. So I've just left them there. And yeah, so far so good. Like the morning was so stressful. Like the morning was crazy. Like I couldn't get permits and it was just a whole mess. And the cops stopped us. Um so yeah, things are back to normal now and the shoot is going great. From a budget point of view, the cost of shooting a music video will always vary. I've shot music videos with 50,000 Rand and I've also shot music videos with 1 million Rand. Some of the determining factors are the number of people you have on set, the level of expertise of those people, as well as the number of locations you have and the type of equipment you use. All of those things combine to determine the overall budget. Last location for the day, and then we are at G for Chan. You are definitely the most hardworking DOP I've ever seen. How much is this car? Right now, it's about two million. <laughs> <laughs> let me Body ask you this again. Let me let me ask you this again. How much is this car? Two million. Two. Two bars. Two. You telling me it's two million? Two million. <laughs> There's no way, guys. What? Something like that. 
You guys are driving around in a house. Basically. Basically, yeah. My house don't house. even cost my house don't even cost as much as this car costs. <laughs> what the hell? Passion, passion for racing. Why everyone sing along? You all know the way. <laughs> right now you all know the way. Yes, way. Director directing. I look sick. How are you guys feeling? We're almost done. Oh, it's like I'm as fresh as I was when I woke up. You're lying. Please don't lie to me. How are you feeling? So much energy. So much energy. Really? <laughs> Let's kick it off. Let's finish it off. That's a wrap for everybody. That is us. That is us, guys. Nice one. Are you uh, happy? This, I'm so happy. This music is going to be amazing. It's going to be amazing. It's going to be dope. So it is done. I am finishing off um, some last minutes. Well, it's not last minutes. It's like. Um, then the Iricon and just like finalizing closing off this project, Malimani. Um, so that's what I'm doing now. I'm chilling. It's so noisy here. I don't know if you guys can even hear me. So I'm chilling at this restaurant. I don't know where it is. It's something Durban. And my flight is for nine o'clock tonight. And back to Jersey. That is my work, guys. That is one of the things I shot for Remy Martin. And this is where I'm gonna end today's vlog. I just touched down in Johannesburg and I need to find, well, I need to find, I need to find oh, my friend. <laughs>